What's up everybody? It's Easy, Easy Street Gaming. Bring you another Brutal Age video. This is the Brutal Age Partner Guide, Part 13. Big 13. This is the Heroic Healers. We're going to go over all the different healers in the game. Most of them. Not going to go over all of them, but most of them. What they do... Uh, you'll be surprised why... Well, I'm going to get into kind of why some of your three-star healers are actually more powerful than the five stars. It's kind of obvious when you think about it, but it doesn't come to... It didn't come to me right away. Maybe it didn't come to you right away. Um, and, and I'm going to show you them all in action. We kind of skipped along. We didn't really... I didn't show a whole attack. I just kind of skipped through all the different attacks with them in, in action. So you can see each one of their, their abilities. So uh, just briefly, we'll go over this first. Uh, just a little concept. The reason why some of your three stars are more powerful than your five stars is simply because you can feed them more of the same type of hero. So your three star will have all of their abilities maxed out. So instead of having a five star that has that you haven't fed any other five stars to, you had like the blue berserker that you fed uh, ten other berserkers to. So he's almost maxed out in all of his abilities. So let's go with the first one. It's a quick pace video. First one is called the, uh, this is the red guitarist. Uh, one of her attacks is called the Fire Medley. So while she's attacking the opponents, she will, the lowest uh, hit point player on your team, um, she will heal them. It's like 15%. It's a small heal, but she does like four or five attacks. So she'll heal four or five times. The Blue Guitarist has the same exact attack, same exact, um, same exact results. I believe that if they do a critical rate attack, they have what's called healing. Uh, Forbidden or Nirvana one of those two is either healing forbidden or Nirvana <laughs> Which means two totally different things <laughs> So now the the red guitarist her big ability is called life story Once you have her at a high level life story is a huge heal as a huge heal It's a whole team heal and it can bring that the team up like four or five thousand hit points depending on how strong she is Now you have the green beast a different type of healer. He doesn't actually heal the team uh, hit points wise but he revives a deceased a dead partner so once one of your heroes dies the green beast can bring him back to life and at a certain percentage doesn't doesn't bring him back 100 percent full hit point or health point but uh, as you can see right here the, the desert prince goes down and now the green beast is getting ready to have his turn someday and it's called don't play dead it revives one partner and it recovers a, a specific percentage of the original hit point so it's not full hit point uh, revival now the, the blue guitarist going back to her she has a very similar ability where she can revive one partner hers is called tune of the sun and she'll revive to 40 percent of max hit points and this is where i knew i saw nirvana i knew it <laughs> this is where she can if she does a critical rate attack during this ability um, she can get Nirvana on herself. You're gonna have to look that up because I can tell you what it is and I'll be wrong <laughs> We're gonna get into some of the stronger partners now This is one that you probably haven't seen a lot of yet because this just came to us uh, last month Jello he's literally a, a, a healer on acid <laughs> his healer ability is acid armor which makes the team invincible for one round uh, it also makes a team immune to a certain buffs for two rounds. His attack is called Acid Hunting. It's a single, single target attack. And he'll also recover 20% of that hit points to himself of the damage dealt. So he's one of the attackers that when he attacks he recovers uh, hit points himself. He also does a heal called Nutrition. And he just randomly picks two teammates and they'll get 20% hit points. So the the reds got several pretty good uh, pretty good heals. Uh, blue and green also have different abilities, but we're not going to get into them in this video. Uh, blue colonel. Now both colonels that I'm going to show they they're both very strong healers, especially once you get them up in the, into the high level six six star. Uh, Battle pioneer. It's a thirty percent hit point, twenty percent uh, action bar for the entire team. So this is an entire team heal, which is a really strong heal. Um, her attack is called Overwhelming Slash. Now it's in a single target attack, and it's also like an attack plus a debuff. So m most of her abilities are not just one thing, but it, she's doing several things at one time. Now she also has what's called the I thought it was Valkyrie, but it's Valkyrie. Who knows what that's a made-up name. I'm that's a made-up name. They made that up. <laughs> uh, the Valkyrie Blessing. Which is like 50%. So as soon as you almost kill something really tough, she brings it back to 50%. Which really pisses me off. 
Now we have the blue berserker. This is this is one of my picks for your your first three star. Um, the blue berserker does the wild roar, and it recovers team hit points based on his his hit points. So the higher his hit points, the more hit points he recovers for the team. He also has uh, another ability called unyielding. It's, he does it on himself, and you'll see as they're hitting him, you'll see unyielding, unyielding a lot, and that's just uh, a, a deflection type defense. Now, gr Green Valkyrie, she has that same Valkyrie's blessing, which is uh, to heal one partner at 50%. Now, she, you can also do a critical rate attack on that and get the Enduring Healing for three rounds. Uh, also, like Blue, she also does the Overwhelming Slash, which is the same thing, the single target attack with a 75% to, to debuff. But unlike Blue... And I think we're getting to it in a second. Unlike Blue, she can bring back a partner. And when she brings back the partner with Revive, and unlike the Blue uh, blue Guitarist or the Green Beast, she brings them back at 100% max hit points. So that is a, that's a huge um, Revive. But as we mentioned earlier, her abilities are stronger than the Green Beast and, and stronger than like the Blue, the blue Guitarist. But because it's a lot easier for you to max out the abilities of the Green Beast and the Blue Guitarist, that's why a, a lot of their abilities kind of even off. So, we'll go down to the top 7. Number 7 I would say would be the Green Beast. He's an attacker and, the, and he has a revive. Uh, number 6, Blue Guitarist who has a decent heal plus revive. Blue Colonel is an equal attacker to an equal healer, so it's both strong attack and heal. Jello, all of them have strong team buffs and assorted healing. Green Colonel is a great attacker, plus she has heal and revive. Uh, red, red Guitarist is number two on the list with a, with a strong heal. And number one, just because of how well you can get his abilities up there, is the Blue Berserker. Now there's also additional healers you can get, like the Bird Shaman, the Green Guitarist, blue, uh, the Blue Blonde. The blue little flower you can get all these they're all they're all healers and in future videos I'll tell you all the ones I missed so f final note don't be afraid to use your healers in your attacks make sure you have at least one healer several healers is better than no healers you want to make sure you have healers in every one of your attacks understand all the healers and you will be a lot better in the partner game hope the video helped enjoyed making it hope you enjoyed watching it till next time it's been easy take care everybody